Hi, I'm Chris Caulfield, the Vice President of Sales and Global Customer Development at Temptime Corporation. Temptime Corporation is celebrating its 30th anniversary this year. We were founded in 1987 when a small group left Allied Chemical Corporation to form our company right here at this location in Morris Plains, New Jersey. For the last 30 years, we've been developing time temperature indicators used on vaccine vials globally to the tune of 600 million units a year. Over the last 30 years, we've had more than six and a half billion of our devices used on vaccine vial monitors that help assist healthcare workers in developing countries reach previously unreachable children to provide them life-saving vaccines. Our mission at Temptime Corporation is to improve the global health care of people around the world. We have our devices on vaccines. We have our devices on uh, medical devices around the world. We actually also serve the United States military by including our devices on meals ready to eat used by the United States military, on medical devices used by the United States military. We have our devices going directly to patients' homes that have chronic diseases so that they know that the medication that's critical to improve their lifestyle has been delivered without any sort of temperature excursions. Temptime Corporation believes that it is our duty and our mission to help improve the global health care of patients wherever they may be. To that end, we continually improve our portfolio of products, moving from our core chemical temperature indicators and now more recently expanding that offering to electronic data loggers. Our Edge electronic data loggers are unique in that they offer Bluetooth-enabled functions, allowing people to improve their productivity, allowing patients to understand whether or not their product has seen temperature excursions during delivery, and allowing those in the healthcare industry to improve their productivity, to lessen the overall cost of temperature monitoring, and to have better outcomes. Temptime Corporation is a group of 80 people based in Morris Plains, New Jersey. We are a fully integrated organization. We have research and development. We have our quality and regulatory functions. We have our commercial functions. We have our administrative and finance functions. We have our quality assurance and quality control functions. And most importantly, we have our manufacturing functions all under one roof in Mars Plains, New Jersey. We export 85% of the product that we manufacture. We have helped grow our organization over the 30 years from five people to 80, so we've been able to add jobs in the state of New Jersey. And we continually look to expand our reach. We have business offices in Beijing, China. We have long-term partnerships in India. We have distribution partners in Mexico and Russia. We are a global organization constantly seeking to expand our reach and to improve the global health care of our customers and those patients around the world. Temptime Corporation is the only pre-qualified supplier of the vaccine vial monitor globally. We have been fulfilling this role for more than 20 years. We service every major vaccine manufacturer in the world, including more than 30 vaccine manufacturers in China and every vaccine manufacturer in the country of India. Temptime Corporation also holds two US FDA 510K medical device clearances. These devices are used to monitor temperature on blood bags, that is our safety view temperature monitoring device. We also have a US FDA clearance for our heat marker device for use on temperature sensitive medical devices. For more information about Temptime, our history and our products, please visit us at temptimecorp.com or contact us via email at info at temptimecorp.com. Hi, my name is Katie Cravroth. I'm a business development manager with Temptime Corporation. I've been with the company about three years and my primary focus is working with specialty pharmacies on temperature monitoring solutions. Transchuckers are single-use temperature monitoring devices commonly used during the shipment of temperature-sensitive drugs. They provide a simple visual indication as to whether or not a specific temperature has been exceeded for a period of time during shipment. We offer heat, freeze, and dual indicators and a variety of temperature thresholds so the pharmacy can select the appropriate indicator to use for the drugs that they're shipping. Many medications can be damaged or lose strength if they're exposed to certain extreme temperatures. So the TransTracker offers an inexpensive, accurate solution for pharmacies to alert patients to drugs that have potentially been damaged during shipping. The 
indicators are really easy to use. They're always active, so there's no extra step of having to activate the indicator by pulling a tab or pushing a button, which can sometimes leave room for human error. However, because they are always active, they do have to be maintained under proper temperature control until they're used. So we recommend keeping the indicators either in the refrigerator or the freezer, depending on the type that you purchase. At the packing area, we suggest bringing them out in an insulated cooler um, with a few frozen gels or refrigerated gels and just kind of pulling from there as you need them. And at the end of the day, whatever is remaining, just put that back in the refrigerator or the freezer. Within the pack out, the trend tracker should be placed as close as possible to the drug so that you're getting a true reading of what the medication temperature is. We recommend including a patient educational letter within the pack out as well that helps explain to the patient what the indicator is, why it's there, how to read it, and also what to do in case it has triggered. It helps the patient realize the value of the indicator and also eliminate some of the phone calls that the pharmacy may possibly get if you didn't include the letter. We do have some patient educational letter templates available that we supply the pharmacies with that they can customize and make their own. It also is important that the patient reads the indicator immediately upon opening the package so that they are getting a true reading of the temperatures experienced during shipping. Trend tracker indicators are offered in a variety of different temperature thresholds. The pharmacies carefully select the appropriate temperature to monitor based on the known stability of the drug and also any short-term excursion allowances. Trend trackers help provide patients with peace of mind knowing that their medication has maintained appropriate temperatures during transit. Simultaneously, for the pharmacy, it reduces the amount of unnecessary reships that are often sent out due to packages being incorrectly suspected of temperature damage. A lot of times, if it's extremely warm that day or a patient worked late and their medication was delivered, they think automatically that the medication must be damaged because it had to have gotten too warm. And without having an indicator in there, there's really no way for the patient or the pharmacy to know whether or not it, it has been exposed to damaging temperatures. That typically results in the pharmacy having to do a very expensive reship of the drug. So the trend tracker really just helps take the subjectivity out of it for the patient as well as the pharmacy. Pharmacies using our indicators have reported saving over $7 per every dollar that they've invested in the indicators. And that's largely due to a reduction in unnecessary reships based on perceived temperature damage when the drug may or may not have actually been damaged. They've also reported a significant reduction in patient phone calls related to temperature because now the patient has that information in their own hands. They don't need to contact the pharmacy Trend trackers can also be used as a very powerful sales tool when promoting to physicians or also when competing in RFPs for pair contracting or limited distribution medications with manufacturers. It's a best practice and helps strengthen the pharmacy's quality assurance and it's really something that they should be promoting and talking about and it's something that helps differentiate them from competitors and gives them an advantage. If a patient were to call and say that they think that their indicator has triggered, you would first want to make sure that they did look at the indicator immediately upon receiving the package. Um, so you want to ensure that they're getting a, a, a true reading of what happened during the actual shipping time until the drug reached them. Once you've assured that the patient did in fact look at the indicator immediately upon opening the package, you'd want them to visually describe to you what each indicator looks like. So with the heat indicator, which is called the limit marker, there is a small white window on the right hand side of the indicator. If it has been exposed to its heat threshold, the window will turn red in color. As for the freeze indicator, there is a small bubble filled with a clear liquid. If the liquid has turned white or cloudy in color, that means it has been exposed to freezing temperatures. If it's determined that the indicators have in fact changed color and exceeded their threshold, at that point you would want to follow standard pharmacy operating procedures for handling temperature concerns. Commonly, this involves contacting the drug manufacturer to inquire about drug stability and also any extended stability data for that particular medication. If it's determined that the drug has been compromised due to temperature, the pharmacy typically sends the patient a replacement shipment. So 
a lot of times we get phone calls from patients who want to do some type of a home test on the indicator to ensure that it's working. Uh, often we find that they do what we call torture tests, which involves placing, say, the heat indicator in the oven or in their microwave over an open flame, um, things like that. And essentially that doesn't really replicate a real life shipping scenario. And so what it does is it just permanently damages the indicator to the point where it's not gonna work. The best way to do a home test of the device for the limit marker heat indicator would be to just place it in your pocket and walk around the house for an hour and then check it visually. And then again in two hours, look at it again. That should be sufficient enough time for the indicator to have triggered. As for the freeze indicator, the best way to do a home test would be to place it in your, your standard freezer at home, leave it undisturbed for about 45 minutes, and then visually check the indicator at that point. Hi, my name is Mark Apedia. I'm the Senior Product Manager here at TemTime, handling the electronic devices. My major role is providing marketing materials so that the customer can understand how the edge devices will benefit their applications within cold chain performance. TemTime offers a family of temperature data loggers that we refer to as the edge. The edge are designed for wireless connectivity, tracking of the device, as well as being able to upload it automatically to the cloud. Uh, it can be accessed wirelessly and it uses low energy Bluetooth technology. Uh, which allows them to access the information directly through packaging, through freezers, and can be uploaded to the cloud immediately. We have three different products that are currently available. We have the S400 and the M300. Those both are used primarily for transportation or shipping applications. They also could be applicable for certain uses for facility monitoring. The S400 is a disposable device. The battery in it lasts for three months and then can be disposed of. The M300 has a similar application, however, it is reusable and the battery lasts for one year and can then be replaced. The final device is the W200, which is specifically designed for monitoring facilities, whether it be for ambient temperature and humidity of a warehouse, or if it's for storage devices like a refrigerator or freezer. The unique feature with the W200 is that it uses the LoRa communication technology. LoRa stands for long range. What that means is that it has the ability for connectivity within a 10 mile radius. So you could be within one facility that's a very large facility, or it could be multiple facilities within that range. The Edge devices differ versus the other competitors' products in a few different ways. Uh, the first one is that it utilizes low energy Bluetooth technology. What that does is it allows the customer easy access to the device using their free app on their mobile device. And they actually can read the product through the packaging or through a freezer. The second way that it differs, it also provides immediate access to the information by uploading it to the cloud automatically. It provides access to anybody anytime, anywhere, as long as they are an authorized user. The third thing is that it also provides immediate access to it, and you don't have to use a computer to download the information. You have the information right away, and it can be uploaded to the cloud immediately. The Edge devices are extremely easy to use. The first part is the setup is very easy. You just have to go through a few different steps and it should be under a minute that it's customized to your requirements. Additional simplicity is that the S400 is pre-programmed with a very common application so you can just run with it and be done. The second thing is that installation is very easy. All that's required is to download the free mobile app onto your mobile device, whether it's a phone or tablet. There's no IT resources that are required. On the W200 specifically, there is only one initial connection that is required for installation. But since they are wireless devices, you do not have to hook it up to any kind of power source or a network connection. The last and most important thing is that you can easily access and securely access the information. The way it's done is it automatically uploads the data to the cloud so that anybody who's an authorized user, no matter where they are at what time, they can access it automatically. And it does this in a 21 CFR Part 11 compliant manner.
The Edge device can be used in multiple applications within multiple markets. The first one would be using it in shipping applications. This would be so that you can monitor the temperature going from one destination to the next, and you would be able to access the temperature data throughout that shipment. Another application for the Edge device is to provide qualification for your packouts and your shipping lanes. You would be able to monitor the temperature throughout the shipment and you'd be able to generate reports for your regulatory or your accreditation requirements. Another application would be using it for monitoring facilities. This could either be just measuring the ambient temperature within a facility or the humidity or measuring storage devices like a refrigerator or a freezer. In addition, the edge devices can be used in clinical trial applications. This would allow you to measure the temperature when it's going to the provider, whether it be a hospital or a physician's office. The first major benefit for the edge devices is that they are easy to use. The setup literally takes under a minute and you just go through a couple different steps. The second thing is that the installation is very simple. It's just a matter of downloading an application and they're all wireless, so there's no requirement to install any wires. The last thing is that you do not need a computer to download the information. It can be automatically uploaded using your mobile device to upload the data via the app. The second major benefit for the Edge device is the accessibility to the data. It can be automatically read through the packaging or through a freezer. You do not need to take it out of the product. Additionally, the data is uploaded to cloud automatically so that anybody who's considered an authorized user can access that data anytime, anywhere. In addition to that, the communication that is used is very secure because it has multiple layers of encryption. When talking about the W200 specifically, the major benefit is the long-range connectivity. You can use it for anything within that 10-mile radius.